Most people will agree that the air conditioner is one of the essential functions of their car, especially in hot climates like here in the Southwest. However, cars were not equipped with AC until 1939. Today, every motor vehicle is equipped with modern air conditioning systems. If the AC system is not working correctly, it is a good idea to have it checked. There could be a leak and you are losing refrigerant. There are repair shops that specialize in the vehicle's air conditioning systems. A common question is, does in-car air conditioning consume fuel? It's considered a bit of a myth by some, but it is in fact true. Having windows open can also cost you fuel, increasing fuel consumption by 8 to 10 percent. Suppose it comes to the decision of air conditioning versus open windows. In that case, opening your windows up to speeds of around 55 miles per hour is more economical, as running the AC at low engine speed creates extra stress and demand, resulting in increased fuel. Above 55 miles per hour, running the air conditioning is better than the extra drag caused by open windows. In Nevada, however, during summers, the air conditioner probably will run on high every time you drive. Don't forget that your car's AC system should run for at least five minutes every week, even if it's not needed, to keep the system lubricated and free of leaks.